guys. If this is your first time watching this channel. If you want to learn something new. Want to fill your head. And increase your knowledge. Please subscribe and activate notification alerts. So you won't miss anything. This is an amazing story. About how a man found a wolf cub caught in a trap hanging in the forest. Boris lives in a village near the forest. At here a large number of wild animals live. Unlike others. Boris doesn't like to hurt animals. He is passionate about helping them. The man takes his weapon. And goes to the woods every day to pick mushrooms. He won't use his weapon. Unless he is in danger. Despite the fact that predators are common in that forest. Boris works hard to protect the forest from rubbish every time. He always clears the forest. He can clear out a bag full of rubbish every day. What made the people of the village start laughing at him? One day. This man went to collect herbs as usual with a rubbish bag. And a basket in his hand. He went to the forest. As he wandered there. He found a pack of newborn wolves lying under a tree trunk. He found them breathless. Boris heard a voice approaching them. He turned to remain alert. Suddenly. A she-wolf appeared. She approached the cubs. And hugged them. The man was sure these are her cubs. Boris tried to leave them. In case of an attack. He quietly turned away. At this point the she-wolf stopped where she was. Realizing that man was non-aggressive. Boris continued walking through the woods. But he was startled by the she-wolf. As she kept following him. Then he decided to follow her. And see what she wanted from him. The mother wolf returned to the place where her cubs had been. At this point. The man understood that the mother wolf was trying to get him to help her cubs. The man used his previous experience with animals. To provide first aid for the cubs. Four of them were in good health. But one cub still had health problems. It was coughing. Had difficulty breathing. And could not stand up. Boris laughed. The mother wolf approached him. She took the cub in her mouth and placed it on the ground next to her. Then the man realized that she wanted him to take her child with him for treatment. Boris left quickly with the cub while the mother wolf kept watching him. Boris noticed that the wolf cub was in a serious condition. He immediately went to the vet in the nearest city to the village. In there, the vet treated it gave it some medication and vitamins, then advised Boris to feed it carefully. When the man returned, he put the wolf cub in a room. During this time the man named it aloof. One of Boris's neighbors was called Dimitri. The man always tried to offend the whole village. But Boris stood in front of him every time, to stop him from doing so. Dimitri unsettled by the presence of the wolf. In Boris's house. He told Boris many times. That the wolf should leave. It should go back to the forest. Because it was a threat to the villagers. But Boris refused his requests. And drove him away every time. One day. Boris and the cub were in the forest. Boris suddenly felt sick. He rushed home first, leaving the cub behind. When Boris arrived home, he noticed smoke coming from the window. He found that the window glass was broken, and the kitchen was on fire. Boris tried to put out the fire, but inadvertently lost consciousness. When he recovered, he found himself in the ambulance. He looked at the people around him and thanked them for saving his life. But the emergency workers told Boris that it was the cub saved him. Boris looked at her 
now he knew that it was the wolf cub its four brothers and its mother who had saved his life. They had combined their efforts to pull him out of the house. Later they found out that it was Dmitri who had set fire to Boris's house in retaliation for his arrest by the police. Thanks for watching. Please like the video and share it on your social networks. We will get back to you as soon as possible.